Hey guys, what's going on? It's Obes Gaming back again with another video. And Bundesliga team of the season is finally here. And with that, we have an objectives card. And it is a flashback Roussillon from Wolfsburg. So we'll jump in, we'll take a look at the card itself, look at the objectives, and then build a squad to get it done as fast as possible. Alright, so jumping into the objectives we have. Here he is, flashback Roussillon. 93 pace, 88 dribbling, 73 shooting, 86 defending, 84 passing, 88 physical. That looks great, especially with the shadow on it to boost that defender. That's going to be insane. So looking at the objectives themselves, we've got defensive delivery. Assist five goals using defenders in the live at friendly Bundesliga best. Assist two goals with crosses. In Bundesliga best, eye for goal, score 15 goals, nice and easy. Wolfsburg winner, win 8 matches, and finally, fine finishing, score a finesse goal in 12 separate matches. So on the face of it guys, this one looks nice and easy compared to some of the more recent objectives cards. And for what looks to be like a very nice, very linkable card. Alright, so we'll jump in and have a look at the cards in-game stats itself, and then we'll build a squad to get it done as fast as possible. Alright, let's go. So, take a look at Ruslan. He is 5 foot 9 with high medium work rate. Obviously left footed and he has 3 star skills, 3 star weak foot. I mean, that's not ideal but at the end of the day for a full back it's probably not going to bother you too much. Looking at the stats themselves, he's got 93 pace which is 92 acceleration, 93 sprint speed, good balance. Shooting's pretty poor, 71 finishing isn't ideal but again we're not really going to be too worried about that. Passing looks nice enough, 83 vision, 92 crossing's really nice. Good short passing at 85, decent enough long passing and good curve. You could boost that up if you wanted to, but I don't really think you'll need to on a fullback. Dribbling looks lovely. 85 agility, 89 balance, 86 reactions, 89 ball control, 88 dribbling, 85 composure. So he's got he's got some really good dribbling stats that and being insane in any individual one. The 89 balance is quite nice. Defending's really nice as well. You know, bear in mind you are gonna stick a shadow on this card and max out the pace. And with that, all the important defensive stats is it gonna be up into the sort of 94, 95 territories there. And the physicals are nice as well, 82 jumping, 90 stam, 88 strength and 87 aggression. So he's going to be really good for winning the ball back. He doesn't have any traits to, to of note. Um, but yeah, let's jump in and build a squad to get this done as fast as possible. So the friendly itself is Bundesliga best. And the rules for that are that you need exactly 11 Bundesliga players with a minimum of five clubs. And with that, five nationalities and regions. So pretty simple enough, you're going to want to build a sort of varied Bundesliga team. But obviously with it being 11 players, it doesn't say anything about it within the squad, so you can put whoever you want on the bench. And obviously that's going to really help us to be able to sub on who we need. Jumping in, we are going to use a 4-4-2 because obviously the crossing objective is going to be important. And obviously 4-4-2, you're going to want to be getting your fullbacks nice and high. And, uh, and it gives you the option to have wingers as well to cross it in with. But obviously you're going to want to build as good a Bundesliga team as possible from, from what you've got in the club and obviously from what you can pick up on the, on the market. So in goal we're just going to go with Pavlenka because you know keepers aren't going to matter too much. Um, someone who I think is going to be quite key here is obviously going to be the fullbacks. If you're going to be trying to score and assist with fullbacks then I'm going to go for Alfie Davis because he does have that high pace and he has got decent dribbling stats as well. Again, you are just going to be filling this up with the best Bundesliga team you have. So if you did manage to pick up any rewards recently, stick them in. I'm going to be using my Alaba that I picked up red and a Kanji. And similarly, at right back, we are going to go with team of the season, Mukiele. Uh, I did do a review on the channel a couple of weeks back of how brilliant he is. And uh, outside of that 50 shooting, which I know is not ideal, he has got some really good stats for going forward. So he can literally bomb up and down the wing if you need him to and have shots. And then, obviously, again, for the rest of the team, there's there's nothing in here like there has been the other objectives like skills and weak foot. So you are going to really want to just build the best Bundesliga team you have. So we're going to go with Thorgan Hazard there. And on the other side, I think I'll go with Bailey just to be absolutely pace abusing. Up front, I'm going to use my foot birthday Rash, uh, Rashford, Royce, um, purely because, again, he's just going to be the best of the best there, really, from the Bundesliga. And, uh, and to pair him up, we, we're going to go with Chan centre mid. Not the standard Chan. We're going to go for the fit, foot birthday Chan. But yeah, again, it's not as complicated as in recent week, guys, where you need to focus on skill moves and weak foot. This is more just build your best Bundesliga team and make sure you've got defenders decent enough sort of dribbling stats to get forward. Uh, to partner Chan in centre mid, we are going to go for... We're going to go for Taliso. And up front... With Royce, who have we got in the club? We could go with Haaland. Obviously, if you've got a Lewandowski there, you could use him. And obviously, guys, again, any of you that pack any of these teams this season is going to be super helpful for you. 
because there are no restrictions about the players you use. Someone ideal here would be the future stars Renier. Unfortunately, mine's long on an SBC, so we're just going to use Rashika. But at the end of the day, as I said, on the bench, you can put in absolutely whoever you want. There's no ratings cap. So just put your best attacking players in the bench and also your best defensive players that have the best attacking stats, if that makes sense, because you are going to need to be picking up assists with them. So, for example, here, someone like Cancelo or Navas would be absolutely perfect for this to sub on. But the key thing to remember here, guys, is obviously for the uh, score five goals with defenders, they don't have to be from the Bundesliga. And obviously, it doesn't actually have to be the defenders you start with. So, for example, if you have a Cancelo here, look at him, 82 shooting. So that's a great... You know, he could easily play up front, so you could happily sub him on as a striker. And as long as he's starting as a defender in the sense that, you know, his card is a right back, a centre back or a left back, you can bring him on and play him where you want and it should count. So I'm sure that if it's not working out for me, I'm going to just bring on Cancelo for a Sheikah up front and start bagging him in. And that'll pick up those, uh, those objectives for you guys. So, yeah, that brings me to the end of the video. I hope that helped. If it did, please leave a like and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one. All right, peace.